Organizing Labor Room Learning Objective To organize labor room in a systematic and planned way with all essential equipment and drugs in a functional state. In order to manage all the pregnant women coming for delivery, there is a need for maintaining dignity, privacy and quality service delivery. Every labor room should be organized as depicted in the visual, which helps in better coordinated activity of the staff rendering services. Entry should be restricted only to labor room staff. Entry to the labor room should be through an anteroom or a space for changing slippers, caps, masks, etc. It should be well illuminated. Windows should have frosted glasses and curtains. It should have provision of 24 hours running water. Hand washing area should have soap and running water. Long handle tap, which can be closed with elbow. It should have an attached functional and clean toilet. General equipment and accessories for labor room. A functional wall clock with seconds hand. Wall mounted thermometer. Delivery trolley with multiple shelves. Bag and mask for adult resuscitation. Pulse oximeter. Refrigerator During winters, the temperature of the labor room should be warm and in summers, normal room temperature should be maintained to prevent hypothermia to the newborn. Labor room should have newborn care corner and service area for routine paperwork like partograph, etc. required to be filled in during labor. Labor room should have the following seven trays. Delivery tray. Episiotomy tray Baby tray Medicine tray Emergency drug tray
Injection oxytocin 10 international units should be preloaded and kept ready for use within one minute of childbirth. PPIUCD tray. MVA or EVA tray Every labor room should have a functional newborn care corner NBCC which has a functional neonatal bag and a mask of appropriate size and a radiant warmer which should be switched on at least 30 minutes before delivery. Two clean sterile towels to be kept for pre-warm. Functional baby wing machine. The service area helps in smooth running of the facility round the clock. Partograph Bed head tickets Or case sheets Labor register Refer in or refer out registers Handing and taking over register are available Labor table One or two With footstep to climb Adequate light is essential. Can be fixed lamp or angled lamp. Mattress with clean draw sheet and Kelly's pad or V-drape is in place with a yellow bin kept under it. Kelly's pad and measuring mug should be decontaminated after use by routine method. Drums containing sterilized items like gloves, linen, instruments, cotton swabs and gorge pieces. When you open the autoclave drum, confirm that the color of the strip inside the drum and on the wrapped sets has changed. Remove the strip and place it in the register. If there is no color change, the items have not been properly sterilized and the drum needs to be sent for autoclaving again. Each delivery tray should have pre-autoclaved and wrapped instruments in enough numbers so that one set is available for each delivery. Arranging newborn care corner. Ensure the radiant warmer is plugged in, is functional and switched on at least half an hour before the anticipated time of delivery. Each warmer should have oxygen cylinder at the bottom and outlet catheter connected to the functional and pre-clean neonatal bag. Oxygen cylinder is filled with key tied on it. The oxygen flow is checked under water in a bowl before inserting the tube. A separate oxygen cylinder with flow meter or alternate source along with all necessary accessories should be available. A pre-tested, clean and functional newborn resuscitation bag and mask of appropriate size is kept ready on the shelf just below the radiant warmer. Pediatric suction machine with disposable suction catheter number 10 and 12. Suction apparatus for the newborn should be kept ready. d lees should be available in the tray. Sterilization of the labor room. Learning objective. By the end of this video, the participants will be able to understand how to keep a labor room clean and sterilized. The process of cleaning and sterilization of labor room. Cleaning and disinfection of labor room should be daily at the beginning of the day 
and wet mopping every three hours after wearing utility gloves. The labor table is to be cleaned with phenol or bleaching solution after every delivery. Cleaning of labor room. Clean the floor and sinks with detergent, that is soap water, and keep the floor dry. Clean tabletops and other surfaces like light shades, almiras, lockers, trolley, etc. With low-level disinfectant phenol, that is carbolic acid 2%. In case of spillage of blood, body fluids on floor, wet the area with chlorine solution for 10 minutes. Absorb with mop. And decontaminate the mop in the chlorine solution. Mop the floor again. Discard placenta in yellow bins. Decontaminate the gloves in chlorine solution. Do not throw them on the floor. Do not throw the soiled linen on the floor. Disinfect with bleaching solution followed by washing and autoclaving. Mop the floor every three hours with disinfectant solution. General measures. Unnecessary entries to the labor room must be restricted. Labor room doctors and paramedics should wear a mask all the time. Proper clothing of labor room personnel necessary including cap, mask, shoes or slippers and gown at the time of delivery. Individual autoclaved instruments set should be provided for each delivery. Random swab sampling to be taken from surfaces and disinfected articles monthly. Microbiological samples should be taken randomly at one month interval by settle plate method. A chart depicting cleaning of labor room with time along with signature of the supervisor or cleaner should be displayed in every labor room. Key points. Individual autoclaved instruments set should be provided for each delivery. Delivery tray, episiotomy tray, baby tray, medicine tray and emergency drug tray, PPIUCD tray and MVA or EVA tray should be kept ready all the time. Labor room should have a newborn care corner with radiant warmer and the equipment for resuscitation of newborn baby. Autograph, bed head tickets, labor room register, Refer in, refer out registers. Handing over, taking over register should be available. 